Hello everyone, this is Delphi 5000. How are y'all doing today? So anyways guys, anyways, uh, welcome to another, uh, loadout tutorial for you guys today. So anyways guys, for today we're going to be introducing the new Meta, the Milano. Now the Milano's been in like a Meta for, I think, quite a few months now actually. It's been a Meta, uh, for, yeah, for quite a while actually. So, uh, I just realized that this has been a Meta for like a few months now, so... Uh, I've seen videos of it and stuff, I'm like, you know what, I'm going to try this out, so, I did a gameplay without clipping it, um, today, and I broke, I think, about a 5 or 6 kill game just using that gun, so, um, the gun is really helpful, and it's really good, so, uh, I was going to clip it, like I said, but it just, it failed, so, I, I broke, like, a 5 or 6 kill game, and then, like, <clears throat> And then, like, I was holding off on the pri on the prison block roof, and they're like, I think a full team came in or something like that, and I about had almost all of them. So, like, one dude came in, I sh I downed him, and then no dude was shooting me, I downed him as well. I killed both of them by throwing a knife, of course. And then there was two more that was downstairs, and I didn't see them, and I ended up dying. So, uh, I might, I think I would have probably had them, so, um... Anyways, guys, uh, you won't do just the regular Milano. Um, you're gonna go to uh, you're gonna select the red room. Uh, so if you see Milano right here, the Milano 821, you go to Armory, and you should go all the way over to red room. Now, if you don't have it unlocked, that's okay. Just make sure you save your your COD points and stuff. Unless you want to push some COD points in order to get enough of it. So um, I end up having this thing unlocked, I guess, for a while now. So. Same as that, you click on Red Room, and for your attachments, keep them where it's at right now. So, I didn't change any of the attachments at all, so, um, so don't, so like, when you select this, this gun, it will give you all these attachments right here. Remember, don't change any attachments, because these attachments are going to help you out really good. Including the bruiser grip, which uh, it will you you able to stabilize your gun with, with the recoil and stuff. Like it won't just be shooting all the place and stuff. Uh, basically, you can just uh, lock onto the enemies and stuff, and it really helps you. Uh, not too much recoil, or anything like that. It's perfect, uh, no problem at all. So, um, and also for the can excuse me, we'll move on to that in just a second. So, and also. For the magazine, 45 round drum, that's pretty good. Make sure you keep that as well. Same with the marathon stock, that's gonna, uh, let's see. Improve sprint recovery time. So, um, sprint the fire time, that's gonna help you. And then it'll give you the micro flex lead, that's gonna, be, that's gonna help you as well. So make sure you guys keep that equipped as well. And send the agency suppressor, make sure you keep that on as well. Because that's gonna help you a lot. So. And then for this right here, um, like, you don't have to put any cameras on if you want to. You can, you can just keep the cameras on there. So, like, you know, I see, look how it changes the color a little bit of the gun. So, um, so I don't think I'm going to select any camos for this gun. So, it has been really helped me. So, and then the reticle, you can customize your reticles, which, unfortunately, I don't have this thing, like, leveled up. What is leveled up is just I don't have all these things complete, so, um, um, so yeah, um, that's gonna help you, so anyways, and then of course, uh, you can put whatever you want for your charm select as well, so I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put the juggernaug, ca juggernaug cap on there, and then stickers, like, I'll pick, I'll just pick, like, the red skull, and then, uh, and then we'll pick, like, uh, this, and then we'll pick, uh, let's see, We'll pick, uh, what do I want? This, we'll pick this one. And then, I want the, uh, the wolf. Where's the wolf at? I know it's a wolf on, there it is, all the way at the end. I thought it was like an actual, I guess not, so. Um, but anyways, but anyways, for your charm and all that, your sticker, uh, you could just, you could put whatever you want on that. I ain't gonna say what to do for that one, so. And, uh, don't forget to have that gun as your secondary. That's good stays your secondary. And then, of course... Uh, if you already have this gun, make sure you guys equip this. This is the FRA3. Uh, make sure you put the Vulture XO, uh, 
blueprint on there because that's going to help you as well. So you see it changes colors and it's really cool. So um, that gun is still really good right now in Warzone. So uh, make sure you guys have that equipped. I'll go over the attachments again. Uh, so make sure you guys, for your Muslims, make sure you have uh, Spaznaz Capacitator. Make sure you have that. And for them, make sure you have a... Uh, 19.5 Liberator and Optic. Make sure you have the Axle Arms three times. That's going to help you. The stock, don't use stock. Don't use rear grip. Don't use laser. Uh, use magazine. That's uh, that's, that's what's going to be up next. Magazine, which is uh, Spaznaz 60 round. Make sure you have that equipped as well. Uh, and then the underbarrel, make sure you have four grip. That's going to help stabilize your gun and all that. So, um,. Yeah, see, improved recoil control, so, uh, it'll control your recoil and stuff. And then, like, and then, make sure you don't change your camo, because it's just going to get rid of the color effect right here, so you see how it changes colors. Make sure you don't change that, because that's not going to help you, so. And for your reticle, you can pick whatever you want, and then same with the charm and the stickers. So, you can put whatever you want on those veins. So, and then, yeah, so, and then, um... Of course, your tactical lethals, that's your choice, what you want for that. Um, for my, my tactical, I have heartbeat sensor, and then for lethal, I have fur knife. I'm thinking at one point is that I might swap the, the heartbeat sensor for the syringe, the medical syringe, because that's probably going to help me out a lot more and stuff. So, um, But I won't use that, so um, I'm just going to stick with the heartbeat sensor. So, but anyways, guys, hope this tutorial helped you. This is, I think, tutorial number three now. Um, yes, I'm going by, like, number of tutorials and stuff. This is number three now. Um, this is all in Warzone as well. So, um, but anyways, guys, hope this loadout will help you in Warzone. Um, if there's a new loadout that I find out pretty interesting, um, I will, of course, make another video. Make another video clip and, uh, and tell you guys what to put on it. So, um, but anyways, guys, hope you all enjoyed this tutorial and hopefully this helps you out in Warzone for you Warzone players out there. So, uh, but anyways, guys, uh, make sure you guys smash that like button, subscribe, turn notifications, and if you have any, any, and if you have any questions or any concerns, make sure you let me know down in the comments. But other than that, hope this loadout will help you guys. So, uh, but, but as always, stay safe, God bless, have a great slash blessed day, and as always, stay humble and kind. Thank, thank you guys for watching, and adios.